Hi, I am Dr. Monisha Gupta, working as a consultant gynec oncologist in Delhi. Today, let's talk about the uterine cancer. Uterine cancer is the second most common gynec cancer in India, but its incidence is increasing because of increasing life expectancy as well as increasing obesity. Talking about the risk factors for uterine cancer, main risk factor is the increased level of estrogen caused either by diabetes, obesity, or high fat diet. Apart from increased level of estrogen, other risk factors are early menarche, late menopause, having no children by the age of 35 years. Increasing age of more than 55 years is itself a very important risk factor for uterine cancer. About 5% of the uterine cancer are hereditary, meaning 5% of women with uterine cancer have got a family history either in the mother, grandmother or other blood related family. So what are the common symptomatology? About 90% of the uterine cancer, they present with abnormal vaginal bleeding, most common after menopause. But in the younger population, the increased monthly vaginal bleeding can be a symptom of underlying uterine cancer. So once a woman is suspecting of having uterine cancer, she should be evaluated with further endometrial biopsy along with a CT scan or an MRI. And once the diagnosis of uterine cancer is confirmed on biopsy, a woman should be referred for gynec oncologist for the proper treatment. The mainstay of treatment for uterine cancer is surgery, the removal of uterus along with cervix and both the ovaries. In addition, an extensive para and pelvic and parahyotic lymph nodes is to be done, that means removal of lymph nodes. After surgery, the entire surgical specimen is sent for the pathological examination and based upon the pathological findings, the stage of the cancer is determined. The success of surgery in early stage uterine cancer is almost 100% and I would like to say it proudly that uterine cancer is one of the cancer where the success of surgery is very high and women can lead a very normal life. So don't sit at home. As soon as you experience an abnormal vaginal bleeding either in the form of increased bleeding, irregular bleeding or bleeding after menopause, come to see your gynecologist and once you are suspected or diagnosed with uterine cancer, you should come to a gynec oncologist for the proper treatment because the first treatment should be the best treatment for the great results for the cancer. Thank you.